That's the first time I've done this, but a live unboxing. Hmm. So we have, look at that, still peel, still the peel coat on the locks. And uh, I love Fender Squires. They're probably, uh, you know, the top fucking anything out there. Oh yeah, that's a, that's a, man. Not too happy with this Fender Squire. Definitely the green color I was after. Uh, yeah, the neck is just oh, filthy used. It's even got lint, which was an extra charge from the custom shop from Squire. Um, yeah, it's definitely the uh, the Wade Boggs edition. You can see his autograph right there. Great third baseman. So uh, yeah, Fender did a great job. I'm pretty impressed. Let's uh, flip it over. There's the front side. As you can see, it's got the uh, custom uh, matte black tremolo along with the uh, two flux capacitor boosters and the reinforcement uh, headlight plate along with the, uh, the pneumatic tuners that keep the neck in tune because it's got air lines inside the neck there which a lot of people don't know about these Squires is that they were pneumatically controlled. So it's a pretty rare model, um, but you can definitely look it up and find more about these uh, green uh, veneer tops. They're, uh, they're super rare, but you know, I mean, look at that green tone. It, does that not match a Northwest uh, maple? <laughs> yeah, dude. And also these dual single coils that were hot glued together. So we have four single coils with a, a, a control knob. So if you want it like 20 degrees or like 350, then you can cook a pizza there. And then, or two pieces of toast if you turn it down to like four and a half. And then right here, you hit that and it flips the toast over. So it's pretty, uh, pretty versatile really, especially with that green color. Yeah. So anyway, um, just wanted to share that piece. This is uh, not, I don't know, not the best thing, but it, it'll do the job, I guess. All right, over and out. Unboxing of my Squire Green Veneer.